what else we got? Roseway East if Chickens. Fated to die, it'll be pointless to intervene. Then again, maybe we're fated to save him. Maybe. I guess we'll find out on the next Dragon Ball Z. Uh, You're underestimating the importance of the eighth fact. Blankenship, she's okay. But Lunsford has the highest rate of foot goals per game. Foot goals? But if you cross-reference with the skills of the opposing team, his hand goal rate plummets. What? <sighs> Lunsford plays worse against better teams. Blankenship plays better. Okay. Carry on. Uh, nothing? I don't have time for this. Fine, bye. Whatever. You had a name, so I wanted to talk to you. Rude. Um. Ooh. Security lockdown. All personnel, please report to assigned workstations. Report suspicious activity to the nearest safety engineer. Parents who buy anti Clio should have children who buy anti Clio. Welcome, Anton. Personal file. Ooh, this one actually has some. Journal entry one. I feel quite alone. Jameson's the only one here worth anything at all. But even he bristles at my direction. This is quite likely a natural reaction to my pushing him so relentlessly. But if he ever hopes to reach Byzantium, he needs someone applying the correct amount of pressure. I hope he'll come to see the truth. But should that prove impossible, I can at least ensure his work doesn't damage my chances. I shall be keeping an eye on his reports to see if they, too, warrant revision. I can't abide any more demerits against us. Heard Jameson talking to Vaughn today. He was railing against me, claiming I'm using him and everywhere, everyone here for my own ends. I'd expect vitriol from that lazy sod Vaughn, but Jameson? How can he not see? I only have his best interests at heart. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. My unrelenting drive has always set others against me. Yeah. Journal Entry 3. With our latest breakthrough, I believe Byzantium is finally within my grasp. My next promotion will deliver me, I'm certain. So long as they don't see through my attempts to cover for the rest of these fools. Fools, I say! I can't quite shake this unease I seem to be gripped by. This makes no sense. While I have yet to get Trammel to commit to a specific date, he assures me Byzantium could be a mere few weeks away. So why this encroaching feeling of emptiness? Must be a case of the nerves. I know, I'll be accepted and dare say possibly even revered when I finally arrive. Uh, alright. Whatever you... Ah, I don't want to steal. Whatever you say, though. Oh, wait. If there's nobody looking, I can steal all I want. Ooh! Thank you. <laughs> take all your stuff. I'll take all your stuff! Ooh, a workbench. Um, anyone looking? Anyone looking? Oop. Thanks. Um, can I do anything? Uh, can I tinker? I can tinker. Look at all this monies. Okay. Cool. Let's get out of here. I got 500 bits on the Bye. Finals. Bye, Martinez. Anything? Ooh. <laughs> Can I keep it? No. Would have been nice, though. Anything in here? Anything good? Magnum. Uh, what are you? Oh. 
thought I, I thought I heard someone coming. Had it been bad. Still hear chickens. That's seven. That's that is not enough money for me to risk getting caught. Oh, but that Magnum is. Ha ha ha. Cool. Thanks. All right. If I had to look at those yellow walls all day, I'd make a point of sleep on the roof. Dad, gum it. I want to get caught stealing. Uh, Ben Bender is nice and all, but. The ventilation shaft runs from the bottom of the lab to the top of the hill. Over the garage. Thanks. Top of the hill's grafted Thanks. Sit down. Um, what is my... Oh, I still got 60 holes. I don't need to do it myself. It's over here. I can stay here if you want. I should probably... Ooh. We'll take that. Are you, uh... Another workbench. Cool. Hey, Orson. Ah, outlaws, I assume. No. Do me a favor and let me finish this, will you? And then make it quick, please. I'm not an outlaw. Aren't you with the brutes that attacked our lab? No. Aren't you here to pillage our supplies and leave our corpses to the raptodons? No. Uh, I'm here to help. Oh, well, good luck. Thanks. No, we got to carve the thing. It doesn't look just like that. Of course, because I didn't... Hello? Hello? Oh, you're still here. If you haven't already, you might speak to Anton. He can point you in the right direction. I have, but I... Uh, bruh! Who are you? I am Orson Shaw, Chief Behavioral Scientist. I was brought in to study the Raptodons. I was to ensure that, should a problem arise, our team is adequately equipped to deal with them. You did a bad job. They are insatiably hungry, absolutely impossible to control in any fashion, and indeed appear to be powered entirely by hate. <laughs> no amount of studying will enable us to control them, or even slightly sate their aggression. Well, that sucks. So, your research amounted to nothing. Not quite. We are now acutely aware of their weaknesses. Bullets through the head. So like everybody, like anything. <laughs> now that may seem like an obvious conclusion, but believe it or not, some creatures' brains are not in their heads. Uh-huh. Uh, Orson, you idiot. Uh, what are you doing? What does it look like? I'm preparing a personal defense device, or trying to anyway do you need help uh if you run a wire from your capacitor here i why yes i suppose i could thanks you're welcome uh do you need a hand no uh, well yes well uh, no uh, perhaps maybe i left schematics in our storage facility as far as i know the security commander hasn't found them yet I admit I'd feel better where they return to me. Okay. Uh, where's this storage facility? Up the south gate. Follow the road. It'll be on the left, past the old lab. Ah, everything's past the old lab. Care to elaborate? I found an advanced pistol when we moved here, but it's broken. I need those schematics to modify it to output superheated air. It should quite easily burn through raptodon hides. Ooh, that would be nice. Say, uh, you wouldn't happen to have a tube of thermal paste on you, would you? No. Blast. Well, good luck. I hope I see you back here in one piece. Cool. Um. Empty. Ooh. If you're going to come in here, come in here. I don't need him seeing me.
Oh, music box. Cool. And I didn't even get caught. <laughs> Sweet. Sweet. Okay, is that everything I can do here? Who are you? Oh, uh, you're Burke. I don't care about Burke. Burke can suck a toe. Tactical shotgun. Uh, I totes hate you, Burke. We're gonna map. Okay, so what is? Uh, ah, the vendor. Okay. Uh, there's the bar, and in the bar is the vendor, which is where I was going. Yeah, dumb it. Now, sup, homie? I don't think you're supposed to be wandering around. Security's gonna tell you to make tracks. Tough. Want to treat yourself before you go? Something for the road, maybe? Maybe. Uh, you seem eager to get rid of me. I don't really know you. Roseway's supposed to be closed off to visitors. Stands to reason you could be a corporate spy of some sort. Ah. Then again, there's nothing in my contract that says I can't sell to corporate spies. That's true. Your bits are the same as anybody else's. They are. Uh, got time for questions? Sure. Not like I get many customers. Um. Why is this place called the 17th Bar? I'm so glad you asked. Some people say the name refers to the 17 rungs in Auntie Cleo's official ladder of corporate advancement. These people are wrong. <laughs> Truth is, we've been established, closed down, renamed, reestablished, and then reopened a grand total of 17 times in the last 40 years. <laughs> and that makes you the 17th Corporate's still bar. still deliberating over a new name. The matter remains hotly contested in committee, but we're expecting a decision within the next five to seven years exciting times yeah if you make it that long how do you make money with so few people in town technically i'm not in business at all roseway closed down years ago corporate still sends us the occasional shipment of necessities through unofficial back channels of course if something goes wrong like one of our guards drinking himself to an early grave or raptodons running wild corporate won't acknowledge we ever existed well, that doesn't sound very nice. Uh, do you ever get tired of serving anti-Cleo product? Can't say I do. Anti-Cleo products satisfy all of our nutritional needs. At least they used to. My folks filled their whole pantry with all sorts of anti-Cleo products. These days, we don't get much in the way of variety. Maybe some tripicale pasta or some ketchup if we're lucky. I hear it's like that all over the colony. It is. We eat what we can get. And we don't get much. I got plenty. Uh, but let's see what you have to trade. Sure. You need something to clean Raptonon blood out your clothes? No. 